Sema, when you're elected uh, senator of Texas, will you stand up and speak up for Julian Assange? I will. I will. And for anyone who has journalistic integrity. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, how how important is, is, is doing that? Like, why is it so important and specifically? Well, because the journalists who are supposed to be reporting the news and holding elected officials accountable are not able to do that because of the corporate interests that drive this uh, this propaganda machine. So we, we need to uh, break up the media conglomerates. We need to ensure that the journalists who uh, initially got into this industry to report on the news are able to do so without those constraints or those restrictions uh, of, of the, the corporate donors. Yeah. Would you issue, would you demand a full pardon for him? I would. I would. That's I think about answer. that because, you know, what, what he, what he did and what, um, was extremely important and something that we needed to know. L- look at what the uh, Afghan Afghanistan war has revealed is, yeah. is that it one was wasteful, but two look, look at the damage we've done to our military men and women. Yeah. We're, we're so quick to fund the NDAA and, and recruit our young men and women to war, but we're not quick to, ensure that they are taken care of and they are autom- automatically enrolled to receive VA benefits, that they're not um, in a waiting line getting prescription drugs filled or seeing their therapist or just getting to a VA hospital in South Texas. There is no VA hospital. Yeah. They literally have to drive uh, four to six hours to San Antonio to see their doctor. Uh, and that that's something that I do not support in ensuring that um, we no longer go into war based on lies and that uh, our allies are not being bombed in the middle of the day or hospitals aren't being bombed um, is something that, that we need to to take into consideration when, when these uh, journalists are doing their job and informing the, the people of, of what is what our government is doing. Yeah. Uh, well, I think that's a great answer. And um... You know, there's some people on the chat. It's like, you know, they like you a lot because they say you're not doing what Beto did. And he used Spanglish to try to <laughs> sway his voters in his favor and stuff. And you're a true progressive. And we're glad that you joined us here yeah. today.